we are in the middle of tropical season and if you see a graphic like this don't panic now this is the climate prediction center's two week outlook and they're saying that there is less than a 20 percent chance of something developing in the gulf of mexico now once again it is mid-july this shouldn't be much of a surprise but you know this is making the rounds out there now in the next seven days according to the national hurricane center nothing developing out across the atlantic but when we start to take a look at our long range outlooks like this one right here this is the gfs you might notice closely here as we look ahead into next week there's some swirls happening in the gulf it's broad and kind of drifts off towards the west and this is over relatively warmer sea surface temperatures i mean my goodness there's a buoy in the middle of the gulf right now at 87 degrees and then you have the deep ocean content under that which is just a lot of energy that is going to be available for anything trying to develop so to see something like this two weeks out from the climate prediction center saying there's a 20 percent chance of tropical development is not a surprise whatsoever especially this time of year where we're starting to, we're not into the thick of hurricane season but we are getting closer to a more active pattern that you know we're gonna see this time and time again that long range outlook but of course it becomes more of a real near-term threat we're always going to keep you posted here at first coast news at firstcoastnews.com make sure to check out our hurricane central as well so you can forecast yourself and see some of these long range models i'm meteorologist robert spetta